Hi, I'm Sophie Murphy. I am at the Graduate School of Education in the Science of Learning and Research Centre. I'm a PhD candidate, uh, also did my Master's um, by thesis there as well and continued on to be a PhD candidate. My PhD research is about effective classroom discourse, um, effective teacher talk, effective questioning, um, and also is now incorporating some student voice. Um, we're really looking at what is effective teacher talk from a, a student's perspective. That was a starting point and now we are finding out a lot more information about that and then moving into, um, into the notion of student voice. I chose this topic because as a self-professed teacher who talks far too much, um, I am a teacher and I have been an educational leader for a long time, um, I was really interested in the notion of dialogue versus monologue and how effective was this teacher talk and me talking far too much in my lessons um, and what did the research say about this? Um, my research um, is able to be used more broadly in the community by um, stepping outside of my own classroom and that's the exciting bit about being here at the Graduate School, uh, working with great team and great professors um, as my supervisors. I am able to really take on that research and translate it into the classroom, um, working with schools, finding out more about what the research has, says now and has always said, um, and also into contexts outside of the educational context, such as the AFL context, and, um, and working with coaches, but also um, into the wider community as well. Um, personally and professionally, the research has been really exciting for me. Uh, it's taken me on a really exciting journey from um, doing my master's six years ago and, and starting a journey of what is this notion of effective teacher talk. Um, it's also really helped me as an educator. I feel that it's helped other educators. I've been able to translate that information into um, with others. And so personally and professionally, um, I feel like I've grown as a person and my knowledge has grown and I've been able to really um, impact in an area, area of um, education that I'm really passionate about. In choosing a place to study, the graduate education, um, the Graduate School of Education was was a, a really important place for me to be. Um, I had been working closely with Professor John Hattie uh, as, following his research as a teacher and a school leader um, and knew that he was based here at, at the Graduate School of Education. Um, coming to events here at the Graduate School, I was able to meet up with and talk to other uh, professors, other people, lecturers, other people who were doing uh, their research and, and working here at the university. It was a really exciting place to be. It was energised, it was passionate, um, and a place that I really wanted to be. So um, I started the journey as a master's student whilst still working as an educator. Um, but then, as the questions continued, I didn't want to stop that journey. I really wanted to remain here. And so um, I've moved into, into the PhD space and have been able to continue that journey and hopefully impact more people by doing that. If I was giving advice to someone about if they were considering a journey here at the graduate school or if they were considering research, I would say absolutely do it. Um, it will enhance your teaching practice. Um, you'll be inspired by so many other people that are around you um, and get to connect with teams of people, with just people with the most exceptional knowledge, but also be able to invest that time and space to really enhance your own teaching and learning and to be able to, um, to then write and to research and to, to work in other areas and to spread beyond um, what what you even think is possible so it, for me it's been it's been such a such an exciting place to be and I would say to anybody just do it come uh, and join that research journey and and move into that space and uh, and help really translate it out to the school context and to the wider context it, it's a it's a great place to be